Hey guys, Brett here, and today I'm going to show you how to download and upload a page after you build it with the Squeezematic Drag and Drop Builder. So here we have a page. Now this is actually one of the templates that is included with Squeezematic. Normally I would edit the page to get it all set the way I want it, and once I'm done, I will save it and I will click the download button. Once I click the download button, it's going to turn this page into HTML for me and it will initiate a download via a zip. Now what I normally like to do is click the open button. I prefer actually not to save it. So I'll click the open and it will open up my downloaded zip for me. Now you can see in here it says website files and what Squeezematic actually does it turns the entire page into a single HTML file. You can actually see it's only three kilobytes large so that way it loads nice and fast. What you can then do is copy it and then paste it wherever you're saving your website. So I'll go over to my my temp directory here and I'll create a new folder. We'll just call it my site. and then I'll paste my page in there. Now if this is not the index page, as I'm sure most of you know, uh, the default page when you go to a website is index.html or index.php. If this is not to be the default page, if it's a secondary page or an upsell or a downsell that you're creating, you can rename this page to anything you want. So now that I have my page saved on my computer, I can actually open it in my browser by double clicking on it and there's the page that I have created. What I want to do next now is be able to FTP it to my website. Now FTP is going to be a little different for everybody depending on your site. If you don't have FTP set up already with cPanel then you're going to have to look at one of the other tutorials that I have here and I will show you how to set up an FTP account with cPanel. If you do already have your FTP set up, simply use your FTP client to upload this directly to your website. And if you need assistance with that, I will create a very simple FTP tutorial for you as well. So that's how you download your page and save it to your computer. If you have any questions, please feel free to click the help button. I am always glad to be of assistance. Thank you and enjoy.